What's up guys, welcome back for another Death Row Duel video, uh, the next match here in the Cross Banlist Cup, so we uh, finally arrived at the last group, uh, so Group H, again, uh, four very big decks in this game's history with uh, Legendary Six Samurai, which we already know from the last uh, Cross Banlist tournament, Light Swarms, uh, basically, uh, one of the first Light Swarms, uh, Light Sworn decks with uh, Charge of the Light Brigade, just released back then in 2009, uh, Sylvan's Triple Soul Charge dot deck, very good, and of course, course, last, uh, one of the most hated decks here in the game uh, is uh, Dark World from all the way back in 2012. Um, so the first match here is uh, Light Swarms. Uh, so uh, Light Swarm deck, Senate Light Swarm deck from back in 2009 is paired up against uh, Dark World. So let's take a look at both uh, deck lists. The first deck list is, uh, of course, yeah, Dark World, uh, pretty much at full force with uh, Triple Graffa, Triple Graffa, and uh, Snow uh, Bro, the One Beach, the Triple Track Down to the Grave, the Triple yeah, Field Spell, the Gates, and of course, the MVP of the main deck, Card Destruction, rightfully banned, uh, yeah, it's banned for a good reason, so, so many pluses if you draw it here with uh, Dark World, and this was very likely uh, with all of those draw cards, with Gates, with uh, Dark World Dealings, Dragged Down, and Reckless Greed. Again, Reckless Greed is also a very disgusting card here in the deck. Again, because of all the draw cards, that increases your chances to draw into multiples and again bypassing its restriction of uh, yeah, skipping your draw phases or at least yeah, next uh, draw phases if you draw multiple Reckless Greed at the time. And uh, yeah, with double warning, Solemn Judgment, definitely uh, uh, Dark Worlds. Uh, definitely favorite to uh, take a top two spot here in the group. Uh, the second deck list is uh, Light Swords. This is one of the early builds of Light Swords, as you see here in the extra deck, only running 12 cards. Um, it, yeah, it doesn't main deck any tuners. Um, this is just a standard Light Sworn deck. I think I'm, I'm using uh, using Gerald Winston's deck list from back in 2009. Uh, basically, Light Sworn back then at full force. JD was at 2. Uh, Celestia was played in triples. And uh, yeah, with the Cold Wave still legal, Heavy Storm and uh, yeah, Charge of the Light Brigade was at 3. Triple Beckoning Light to reuse all of your light swords and triple honest uh, again very very nice so which deck uh, has uh, the most chances um i can see uh, depending on who uh, which deck that starts um dark world again uh, the reason why dark world is one of the most hated decks is that uh, yeah because of graffa graffa is just that 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 floater card and also because of the, the Seki shenanigans with uh, Drag Down, with all of those draw cards, and mainly because of card destruction, get instant plus four of, or yeah, plus five out of a card destruction is just uh, bullcrap. And uh, yeah, the Dark World also has a very, very good game one without the side deck. The, yeah, the Dark World deck is just superior in most uh, matchups uh, because it's, it's so consistent. Uh, and of course, yeah, the Light Swords do have the advantage of. Uh, the speed and the OTK potential with JD and uh, Heavy Storm, not to forget, and of course, Cold Wave. Uh, so, yeah, let's hop in into the first game. Alright, so the first duel. Uh, I'll be playing Dark World, my opponent is playing with Light Swarms. I get to start, so again, uh, that's definitely in favor of Dark World setting up everything. Uh, and yeah, if I'm able to uh, draw into a drag down, I can get free information about my opponent's hand, uh, pick that. Uh, threat away so I get a nice opening hand I'm not going to set a second warning here because I know the deck is playing heavy storm and of course cold wave and I don't want to get blown away uh, wait until my opponent loses uh, yeah, uses uh, Lumina's effect and then warning it uh, and then yeah here I'm obviously forced to torrential not letting him activate the JD here draw into card destruction and get some nice pluses triggering the dark worlds uh, use their effect so special summon my beach and uh, yeah of course special summon the grab I here uh, get some nice damage. I think I can establish a nice field, uh, but I can't OTK. Uh, I think he has a Necro card now, right? I go for Sengen here uh, because just in case if he's able to go for JD or he ha has a way uh, to uh, get get back into the duel, I can search a Dark World monster with my Sengen. So here, but yeah, I knew I was in a great position thanks to my Mind Crush. Uh, I uh, always, pretty much, I yeah, always knew his hands, and of course because of the the beckoning light. Uh, because I think yeah, the, the, the Light Sworn deck only runs 3 traps, 3 Beckoning Light. I was always able to view my opponent's hand, or at least yeah, get information about my opponent's hand thanks to Beckoning Light. So that Mind Crush definitely was... Uh 
Yeah, definitely was uh, one of the MVPs here to pick away a potential Judgment Dragon. And here, very easy, I can just attack for a game. He gets a start, gets a very good opening and immediately melts the wolf, double solo recharge, and he's able to go for a Garroth. Uh, try to get some pluses with Garroth's effect. He doesn't, but he get, does get double wolf. Uh, immediately gets some nice field presence. Um, and then again, uh, open with double warning. The Tarantial decent, but he already established the field, so I think my only option here is to attack over the Lumina with my Sangen, just in case if he has Honest I can get a search, uh, go for Zen mains in defense and set my 3 back row. But, <laughs> he has Cold Wave, yeah, what can I do? So my, my uh, back row here is stunned, I can't activate anything, and of course, thanks to Celestia, he can uh, destroy one of my, uh, detach, or at least yeah, I have to detach one of my materials with Zen mains. Uh, main phase 2, he can blow away all of my back rows, and I can't activate Reborn, so again, I think my only option here was to still kinda be in a duel, is to go for Zen mains, but yeah, he's, he's still at 6700, so he can just... Just pay uh, multiple times and special summon the second one attack for the game. So 1-1, one, one, again a very close one, but Dark Worlds are definitely again in the advantage seat, have the advantage here. Uh, open up well, so immediately get a dragged down into the grave, get information about my opponent's hand, again very crucial uh, for a possible mind crush, and immediately he reveals the Heavy Storm, so I'm obviously going to discard the Heavy Storm. Uh, I think I have double Reckless Greed here, also the Deck Devastation Virus going to wait until he normally summons this Lumina, immediately flip over the deck death, destroying all uh, low attack monsters, so beneath 1500, and again I can make my mind crush live. Uh, so normal summon to a guide, flip over double reckless greed, such disgusting, uh, such a disgusting move uh, here. Uh, so again, uh, I can go for game, uh, but I think he has a necro gardener, so I I'm going to force it out. Again, I have so much pluses, so many pluses over my opponent, and uh, I think I'm going to search a beach here. Yeah, get it on board thanks to my last gates, I believe. Yeah, no reason to not uh, activate my third gates here again. Draw into more outs, more back row more answers to my opponent's uh, uh, field, to my opponent's JD. Uh, yeah, t -t -t I, I have a, a solemn judgment set, I think. And that's, that's just overkill, more than enough to uh, win this game. So yeah, card destruction still pretty uh, busted here in the deck. Yeah, let's not forget, yeah, double uh, Reckless Greed also was uh, very good. So Dark Rolls do take it, kinda expected uh, that Dark Rolls would take it, but uh, uh, yeah, anyway, so uh, next match will be the last match here for the first uh, part of the tournament. Uh, will be uh, Legendary Six Samurai versus Sylvans. And after that match, it's all the way back to the beginning. Back to Group A. Uh, guys, I'm, I'm trying my best, doing my best to get these matches done as fast as possible. They do take up a lot of time, but I'm doing my best to take, uh, at least, yeah, to play everything out and to get them up as fast as possible. So, guys, thanks for watching and feel free to leave a comment or a like if you enjoyed the video. Leave them signing out. Peace.